part two for the divine feminine male and female collective energy read we stopped on the two of cups this is pisces cancer em energy so your person could have been a water sign that sabotaged the relationship but now they want to rebuild it with you they could have been dealing with a water sign that sabotaged their relationship as well they could have been mirroring each other narcissists in a one-sided relationship both of them give me the six of swords spirit girl talk so your divine masculine is trying to um, move from a bad situation to a better situation male or female they could be talking to people about how to fix this and how to move forward in their lives they could be getting wise counsel or advice and this relationship is evolving to a higher level of commitment for a lot of you divine feminines male or female give me the, the knight of swords spirit why is it here for my divine feminines and what does it mean for us love your divine masculine is rushing in because they have unconditional love for you some of them are working on making healthier choices in their lives they know you have so as you do the work your divine masculine does the work if you want union then you have to make the healthy choices and sometimes those choices can be hard because we all have our addictions our codependencies things that make us unhealthy and unstable in life and relationships give me the four of wands why is the four of wands here for my divine feminines collective male or female and what do we need to know yes this relationship is definitely ascending <clears throat> it's being expanded and it's going through a new phase a lot of you again like i said you're preparing for union you're taking a risk some of you your divine counterparts are taking risks they're leaving relationships that no longer serve them that contract is over it's hit its expiration date and they're talking to people about it give me more energy for the divine feminine collective spirit male or female thank you we have mirror so they have seen who they are based off of how the karmic relationship was between them and their partner and it's going to be different from all of you and it was bittersweet they got the truth as well as you did give me more energy for the divine feminine collective male or female spirit and they're healing their hearts that was the biggest thing and they're taking time out to do so they're stalking they're spying on you divine femmes male or female give me more energy for my divine feminine collective spirit male or female thank you camera some of them have pictures of you they're reminiscing they have keepsakes and they're heartbroken over you but they're going through a transformation see the butterfly so they're transforming they're changing male or female they have nostalgia where you're concerned divine femmes and they are ascending as you have ascended a lot of you divine feminines new phase rekindle renew transformation growth so your person has experienced this where they used to have multiple options maybe they'd only have one you divine feminine yeah your person was a snake in the past for some of you um and for others of you your their, your divine counterparts are finding out that they dealt with a snake it's the other woman a lot of you have had issues with this other woman self-indulgence your person was being selfish greedy and they knew you had a key to their heart that's why they became the runner and you became the chaser and you hold a key to theirs both ways for some of you a lot of you dealt with the hand that was given to you your divine counterpart is you talk to people got help some of you did some of you didn't your divine counterpart some of them deal will talk to people others of them won't they'll just follow the guidance that they're being given and it's leading all to abundance some of you have work to do together <clears throat> photographs looking at your photos missing you nostalgia they want to make new memories some of you this was this started out as a karmic relationship your divine masculine is ending a karmic relationship because this thing is triggering them so some of you had soul contracts where there was karma that needed to be cleared up that's why it was so painful that's why it was so intense for you twin flames and it's coming to an end this karmic relationship marriage wedding polyamory open relationship whatever it is expect a call your person is getting healthy what else spirit can you tell me for my divine feminine collective transformation a lot of you went through transformations became lighthearted as you healed your heart got lighter your persons is doing the same because they're axing what no longer serves them in a relationship like you had to 
and you started giving yourself self-love you started receiving what you needed your person is doing likewise what else spirit can you tell me for the divine feminine collective cupid's arrow is coming directly towards you and they're asking the other one because they're spying on you divine fems coffin that situation is ending because they want to come towards their abundance and they know their abundance lies within you as well as self yes the separation twin flames has been here for a while this karmic relationship left you guys heartbroken and that's why you had to make healthy choices some of you will not hear from your divine masculine right offhand because right now they're saying not today they have too much on their plate but they do see you as stability and they want this security and growth they've got to get out of this self-absorbed narcissistic behavior it's old patriarchal mindsets it's outdated thinking and this is what they're living in and this is your twin flame so your only person that could help your twin is god if he's a narcissist or she's a narcissist because no clinical psychologist or the leading psychologist on this planet can't heal a twin flame only god can do that and get them out of this karmic relationship where they're being heartbroken and they're being forced to make healthy choices because this lightning has come in and this was their addiction here they were chasing money and they knew the whole entire time you had the key to their heart expect a call because some of you are going to get married to your person this person is spying on you some of them still have addictions and they're still a snake but this person is receiving exactly what they need just as you did Div divine feminine in the past they stabbed you in the back now they're being stabbed in the back all behind their lust their passion they are going through a relationship phase where it is dying that karmic relationship is over it's not to come back this is the one they're headed towards the relationship that's evolving to union your person was the runner now you're the runner some of you are going to tell your counterpart that they're not enough because you were frustrated in the relationship and the same thing that's why they're running from the relationship they're in now because it's not enough it's not giving them the love that they sought after you are their palm tree and some of you are going to tell them not today because you are dealing with a lot of different things but this is really your divine counterpart right now they're dealing with a lot of hurt they're dealing with a lot of pain they're going through an ascension from a marriage that they chose to get into or a relationship some of you your divine counterparts got into a relationship because it was a prearranged relationship a lot of you your divine counterparts um, had traditional style types of marriages that appear one way but your person could have been in a religion that allowed them to have more than one spouse or to have open relationships polyamorous relationships but it was codependent and it's right here on the runner addictions were affecting them some of them have serious sexual addictions and this is involving their wedding their relationships now they want a wedding with you marriage commitment stability but they don't know how to come forward to ask because of how they treated you in the past let your friends help you so they're asking friends for help they know there's a strong magnetic magnetic attraction between the two of you but they have to free themselves from this toxic karmic relationship this marriage that they got themselves into whatever this is that they're involved in and there are children there so your love life is being affected by the ch um, children this is telling you for those of you who are still chasing your person pay attention to the red flags and for those of you who have stopped chasing and now have become the runner pay attention if there's any red flags the signs will caution you calling in your soulmate your person is manifesting calling you in there's a magician and it is safe for you to love because they are ready to love you divine feminines male or female not all of them but some of them and this is a past life relationship so some of you like i said some of y'all had to clear out old karma from another lifetime and that's why it was so intense but this love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment that is beautiful any more messages spirit yep 
Your person is worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life because this is the one. You've already met the person you seek. What else, spirit? Very soon, clearly decide what it is you want. Some of you are not in the mood to flirt. Your divine counterpart could have lost all of their uh, flirtatiousness, and that would be a good thing. And y'all need to spend some time getting to know each other. As your bond deepens, you'll heal and you'll grow, and you will get stronger together. What else, spirit? Yep, getting to know each other. Reli Didn't I say religious factors? Religious factors. Some of your people were in relationships that were designed, orchestrated for them. Some of you, they may have issues with what you believe in versus what they believe in. Some of these things are very cultured. It's, around, it's, it's their culture, their belief system. But there's a great deal of passion between the two of you. Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. That is following your heart, not your head. So in the past, your divine counterpart could have followed their head over their heart. Will you do the same this time? Because you do deserve love. You are lovable, divine feminine. Some of you, the relationship was unrequited because your person was already here in this type of situation. Okay, that's what made it unrequited. They were in a karmic relationship. But now this is what it's become because guess where it's going? And I can't make this shit up. Oh my God, this is beautiful. That's where your relationship is heading, family. If y'all can see that. That is amazing. I have the fool taking a leap of faith that's taking a risk. The sun, you're the love of their life with the king of cups, a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They want to apologize. Some of you are very going to be very guarded where your love is concerned because this person is coming in to offer you love. A lot of you are going to feel burdened because you're going to be in your heads about this. And this could create blockages and towers, delays, obstacles, but... There will be a choice that needs to be made. This has been your reading, Divine Feminines, male or female. I hope you enjoyed it. Please like, comment, subscribe, share with your family, friends, and coworkers. You can find me as Ascended Twin 144K on Instagram, Nikita Kelly Ascended Twin on Facebook, and here on YouTube always as Ascended Twin 144K. I love you, Soul Tribe. Y'all stay blessed. Until the next time we talk, peace.